everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be sharing with you guys tips that I do every single day in order to stay on top of things in my home. I find when I do these things I know that my house stays a little bit nicer and put together and things are not piling up on themselves. So if you guys are interested just keep watching. So my first tip is to make up your bed every single day. It doesn't matter if it's in the middle of the day or first thing when you wake up. Get those pillows off the floor and make your bed. It just automatically makes your room look nice. Gives me that motivation to keep going and tackle everything else. So tip number two is to keep disinfectant wipes in multiple areas of your home. I love to use these because I can just throw them away. You can also use a vinegar solution, which I am showing here. Um, but I like the wipes because I can just throw them away once I use them. I find that if I have them in multiple areas of the house I'm more likely to pull it out clean the countertops or whatever needs to be cleaned and sanitized and then I can just throw it away I tend to put things off or I get lazy when I know that I have to go to a totally different area of the house to get a certain product which makes things worse and I never end up cleaning them having everything you need in hands reach is a really good habit to have Tip number three is to try to do at least one load of laundry each day. Having kids and a husband, we tend to have a lot of dirty clothes. So when you do at least one load of laundry a day, you're staying on top of it. Things aren't piling up. Just make sure when you dry them, you fold them that day as well. I have a load here that I'm going to be folding and putting away that are already in the dryer. So right now I'm just throwing in some towels that I need to wash. I'm going to be folding the clothes that are in the dryer. So here are the clothes that I'm going to be folding. These are my boys clothes. I'm just going to go ahead and quickly put them away. They were in the dryer when I put my towels in the dryer in the washing machine. So I need to get these folded and put away so laundry isn't piling up. you guys are wondering if you see me throw any clothes off to the side it's because I hang all of my boys tops up in their closet so those are just gonna be in a pile on its own so that I can hang them up after I'm done folding shopping bags throughout your home. I don't know how many times a week or a day sometimes that I need a bag to put trash in to take downstairs to the trash can, having kids, taking tags off of clothing, mainly for larger items that I don't want to put in the trash cans in our bathroom because they're so small. So larger items, I usually just like to have like baggies available to put those things in so I can just take them downstairs. So we all have those dishes that have to be washed by hand and they're always drying on the countertops which makes your kitchen look a little cluttered. So I like to put them away right when they're finished drying. Sometimes I'll even dry them by hand but these were just out and they were drying. There's nothing like when somebody comes over at your house and you have dishes everywhere. It doesn't matter if they are clean or dirty. It just makes everything look cluttered. So I like to put those away so that I can have a clear surface to work with for breakfast, lunch, dinner, whatever. It may be hard at first to always have to put away the dishes right away, but I promise you guys will get in the habit of it and your kitchen will look much better throughout the day. Doing this also clears up a lot of space for when you do have to wash dishes again, you have that empty space to work with and everything's not piling up. Start your day with an empty dishwasher. 
and this is the middle of the day and I am just putting dishes in from lunch that I don't have to worry about until nighttime when I start the dishwasher. Starting your day with an empty dishwasher just makes things a little bit easier. You can just add dishes in throughout the day and then start it at night. Find a way to manage your paper clutter in your home. I like to throw out all of the junk as soon as I get it in the mail. If it's trash, throw it away and then file everything else. It's so important to have a place for everything, especially if you have kids. So make sure you take the time to show your family where things go and make a place for everything. And that goes for your entire house. Always take time to tidy up your couch area or your living area. Um, this space can look real messy real fast, especially if you have kids. I thought I would show you guys this clip because this is what it looked like the night before and it is now morning time and we didn't clean it up like I normally do each night. So this is what it ended up looking like. So I'm just gonna go ahead and tidy that up. those are the things you guys can do to manage your house a little bit better I would love to know your thoughts in the comments let's talk about it leave me your video suggestions if you want in the comments as well I hope you guys enjoyed it give me a huge thumbs up if you did and don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys on the next one bye